They just got through watching Taggart's press conference. And I'm going to say, um, like, I'm a little worried because his tone is like, okay, yeah, we won and won. We played sloppy. Both games. But so what? We got a long season. That's his approach. I ain't seen no fire. I ain't seen no, no passion. He came out and said, you know what? We got to play better. This is on me. This is me and the coach's fault. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm looking too hard. I understand Jimbo left us in a bad situation. I understand that. I know it's going to take three to four years to get back where we need to be at. But we should be playing this sloppy against team that we should be beating. They gave us one 41-0 last week. They beat the team they should be beating. We should be beating these teams by 30 to 40 plus points. Boise State, we should have came out and, and scored 20 more points that second half and, and took all their confidence away. But what did we do? We came out trying to hit home run balls. We have an inexperienced quarterback. Browns is this and Browns is that. Browns haven't shown me shit. It's different than ACC. I'm going to Big 12 right now. I throw 400 yards and I'm retired. We should be playing better than what we are right now. We all agree that. I just feel like Taggart lacks that experience to say, hey, I'm going to motivate you. You might be a good recruiter. I give you that, Taggart. I'm not taking nothing away from you. You might tell a different story in the locker room. Who knows? But from what I see, my eye test is telling me that this stage right here is real big. You might have turned around Oregon in a year and a half, but it's it's time to change right now. For real. We better made the ball because they had to reschedule a game. Right now, we don't have good wide receivers. Yeah, we have the blue chip athletes. Yeah, we have the stars and everything, the athletes, the good stars. But can we put together a good coaching game? To build the morale, to have these players believe that they are champions. We don't have that much experience on this team as it is. These guys need people to come say, hey, we're going to do this. We're going to do that come game time. And we're going to believe that. This is what we're going to practice. Huh? We got to get on our defensive court and let him know, like, hey, man, that, that's unacceptable. And, and call a spade a spade. It's our defense. It's our conditioning. It's crazy. We be on the field too long. We got to come. We got to put together good plays. We can't run on first down. We can't run on second down and expect to throw on third down like we fooling the defense. Come on, man. Who are we fooling? We got one of the best running backs in the nation. Let's mix it up. Give him some tall sweeps, some jet sweeps like you did Dalvin Cook. Stop trying to run him up the middle. He's not a north and south runner. You might not be a bad coach, but right now you're not looking like you're a good coach for this program. It's going to take another year. I understand that. Maybe I'm in the Maybe I'm impatient. I want it right now. Well, that's all the time I got today, man. If you like what you've seen, y'all already know, man. Hit that like button, man. Subscribe to my channel. No. Hit that bell. Get that notification. So when I upload another video, y'all already know. You watch your boy. Thank y'all for supporting me. Oh.